Hey everyone, it's Bailey here, and today we're diving into some heated discussions surrounding one of the most talked about K-dramas of the season, Queen of Tears. But before we get started, make sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell icon so you never miss out on the latest updates from the K-drama world. Queen of Tears has been keeping fans on the edge of their seats with its gripping storyline, but there's one major plot point that's been causing quite a stir among viewers. From the very beginning, the trailer and storyline led fans to believe that High and was simply a cold chabel heir. But as the series progressed, it became clear that there was much more to her character's backstory. In episode 4, the truth behind High In and High and Wu's failing marriage was finally revealed a heartbreaking loss of their unborn child. The revelation shook fans to the core, as it explained the underlying tension and distance between the couple. However, as the series approaches its final episodes, fans are growing increasingly frustrated by the lack of resolution regarding this pivotal event. Many viewers feel that the writers have glossed over this crucial aspect of the storyline, leaving their questions unanswered, taking to social media platforms like X and Twitter, fans have expressed their disappointment, with one fan stating, the writers have left so many things unexplained, but went with arresting Hyungwoo for the plot instead. Another fan chimed in, saying, I haven't moved on from this incident or plot, several episodes up to episode 14 have been released but there is no complete explanation, despite the unresolved issues. Some fans speculate that the writers may be saving the revelation for a climactic moment that will trigger High End's memories of High and Wu. With only two episodes left, anticipation is running high as viewers eagerly await the series' conclusion. What are your thoughts on the unresolved storyline in Queen of Tears? Are you satisfied with how the writers have handled it so far? Or do you share the frustrations of many fans? Let us know your thoughts and theories in the comments below. As Queen of Terrors continues to keep audiences on the edge of their seats, we'll be here to bring you all the latest updates and insights. Don't forget to catch the drama streaming on Netflix. And until next time, this is Bailey signing off. See you in the next video.